Hey guys, I'm Nick Gulliver and welcome to my channel. Now in this video, I'll be talking about this little kit right here and how you can take your gaming or studio setup from bland to epic. Now there's a lot of great gaming PC setups out there with awesome looks and styles, but in this video, I wanted to focus on great RGB lighting that will help make your gaming or studio space setup feel a little more 3D and immersive with great lighting. Now the guys over at Govi have dropped this product right here called the Gaming Light Kit. Now this kit allows you to sync your lights with your gaming or studio monitor to bring the colors off the screen to the environment around your monitor and create a whole bunch of immersive looks that look absolutely epic. Now, I have created another video if you're keen to check that out. It's my full unboxing of the Govi Lighting Kit product and everything that comes with it and how each part works and what you get in the actual box. But if you do want to check that out, you can click on the link in the top of your screen right now, then jump back into this video after, or you can just wait till the end of this video and I have a link in the videos in the end cards at the end of the video. So now that everything has been removed from the box, basically you should have two light strip bars, with RGBs on the back, a camera for capturing your screen colors, and a light rope for mounting on the back of your monitor. And you should also have, yes, some cabling to connect everything together. Now that I have everything laid out, it's time for me to set up and install the lights. So why don't I jump over to my desk behind me and let's work out how I'm gonna place everything and install the lights. So currently I have some LifeX products in my setup. So let's turn them off and remove them so we can start with a fresh slate. Now with most desk and screen setups, you're going to want to place your light bars on each side of the monitor. Now, depending on your desk size, you'll need to position these closer to or further away from your monitor, giving you the maximum light coverage. Now, the second step to setting up the lights is mounting the lighting rope on the back of your monitor. Now I'm a big fan of this product as they have wrapped the LED strips in this soft diffusion rubber that is super flexible. You do lose a little bit of brightness with this option, but it does a lot better job at diffusing and spreading the light behind your monitor rather than the traditional naked LED strips. Part of what comes in the box as well is these mounting brackets. On the back of the brackets, it has some 3M sticky that helps to keep the rope light attached and stuck onto the surface. To make this a little bit easier so you're not guessing on where to put these brackets, they do provide these positioning cards to lay on the back of the monitor to show you exactly where to place the brackets. So let's jump forward with a little time lapse so that you can see what it looks like once I've finished. Now, when laying out the rope, you will need to make sure that you keep this end closest to where you're going to mount your camera. That helps when you're plugging in all the cables. So with my desk set up, I have a mounting arm that I've attached my monitor to and I have run all the cables down the arm for good clean cable management. I think to make this look as good as possible, you do wanna hide your cables on your desk setup so it's a nice clean look. So now that we have attached and set up your monitor lights, it's time to mount your camera. Now with my camera and my monitor, I have this slight rounded part in the back of my monitor, which is a little bit annoying and frustrating, but I was able to tweak it and move it and kind of basically get it to sit there. Now, it might not sit 100% flush on your monitor, but as long as it feels firm and won't fall off, you're good to go. Okay, now that we have everything installed and in place, we need to download the Govi official app. Now, I'm not gonna go through all of that in this video as Govi has a bunch of videos online and links to videos located in their app that show you exactly how to connect their app, how to set up their products, and also how to calibrate the camera with your screen and monitor setup. But what I do wanna do in this video is show you how their app works with this product. So let's jump into that. So first of all, let's turn on the lights. As you can see from the get-go, these lights are really bright and vibrant. And just using a straight color mode, you can create some really nice looks. You can cycle through the color wheel and choose what colors you want all the lights to be globally on, or you can break it down to individual lights and assign the light bars, for example, to one color and have the light rope on the back of the monitor set to another color. I'm always a big fan of mixing lights together to create really cool looks. The app allows you to choose from a bunch of different modes, but the setting that is their standout mode and why you would look at purchasing these gaming lights is for the video mode. This is where the product really shines. 
So with the camera that is mounted on the top of your screen, it's capturing your screen in real time and matching the colors of the computer monitor and then replicating that in the light bars and light rope on the back of the monitor. This really makes it feel like your screen is a lot bigger and also makes it seem more like you're immersed in the actions and the colors come off the screen. Now the app also allows you to set the lights so they can respond to sound and music. That could be audio from a game you're playing, or it could be a cool song that you're listening to. Now the app also gives you the option of a bunch of pre-made looks and scenes to play around with. But I prefer to make my own looks, so here are a bunch of scenes and looks I created with different desktop wallpaper art. So if you've been enjoying this video and got something out of it, why don't you smash that like button because it really helps support the channel and this video. Now if you do want to keep watching more videos from me or you want to check out the unboxing video, you can click on the videos right now. Well I'm Nick Gulliver, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.